my options. I'm the first brown boy to get it popping. What up guys, it's Labib. Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. If it's your first time on the channel, thank you so much for watching and make sure to subscribe if you are new. So boxing. Boxing has been the latest and newest trend on YouTube in 2018. Last year, it was all about the diss tracks with Ricegum, Logan Paul, and Jake. And this year, it looks like boxing is the new motive. And now these huge new fights are coming out with Logan Paul fighting KSI and his younger brother, uh, Comedy Shorts Gamer, fighting Logan Paul's younger brother, Jake. Being a martial artist myself and practicing MMA for a while, as well as boxing and other facets of the arts, I wanted to give my take on it. I'm so happy I can finally give my perspective, something I've been doing since I was 11 years old, and it's now finally relevant on YouTube. Two of my worlds have finally combined. If you guys are wondering where this stuff is coming from, I'm not trying to show off. I am an MMA fighter myself, so are all my teammates. Here are some clips. Now it's clear that I'm here for a real reason. Cause he got hit like I got hit, but he ain't fucking breathing. In my dog and I can't see. I'm trying to be what I'm destined to be. And niggas trying to take my life away. I put a on some fights I've taken L's too so you know I've been on both sides I'm not trying to be a show off or trying to show that I know more I'm just another person on this platform sharing my thoughts and especially as someone who lives breathes eats MMA and combat sports I had to give my thoughts especially if you guys even go back to my old videos it's a bunch of me training fight camps during Ramadan etc etc it's it's my thing so I had to put my stuff out there first thing first I think the whole thing with YouTube and boxing coming together is actually very dope I think the sport in general is getting a lot more exposure and people training and finally competing against each other is I think a positive thing overall just like Faye Sensei said if you guys don't know him go check him out he's really dope the martial arts and people training for a disciplined goal I think really helps them all overall and I think most of these people after they're done fighting are gonna be better friends than they were beforehand a lot of you know drama on social media a lot of stuff on Twitter and once these people finally box it's gonna be much better than them just talking a bunch of junk on YouTube. So I got some predictions and some expert analysis from my teammates and my coach. They are professionals. They have been doing MMA for the longest time, jujitsu, boxing, literally all the facets, and they're giant sports of the fan of boxing and most combat sports in general. I got their input. Most of them don't even know who Logan Paul or KSI are, but it was interesting to see their take on it after I described them a little bit. Here's some takes and thoughts from my teammates and coach on what they think. So guys. Here with Morty, you know, just chilling, goddamn training. Yeah, they hate it, but they broke them. And when it's time to pop, they have no shit. You got Logan Paul or you got, um, uh, you got KSI? I think I got Logan Paul. He was, he was actually, he was an actually really good wrestler. He took state and everything, so I'm putting my money on him. Well, I think he, and I also think, uh, even though, you know, he messed up on that video, kind of seemed douchey. I, I mean, I still think he's douchey, but he, he's, he's a really good wrestler. If you look past, you know, his check, his... his <laughs> what he did in the video, which is kind of messed up. He's a really, he was a really good athlete, and he's, he's still had good sportsmanship. So you know, I got him. But my boy Morty's got him too. So Morty, who you got? You got Logan Paul, professional MMA fighter uh, Milton Arguello over here. Yeah, they hate, it, but they broke them. They broke them. And when it's time to pop, they have no shit. He's making his KSI versus Logan Paul predictions. As an expert, what's your uh, you know thoughts on this fight? Um, so we got my boy KSY, right? KSY? Yeah, yeah, yeah right there. Or KSI. Looks like athletic specimen, you know. Uh, we got any footage on him? We got, what the fuck is this? Oh, that's Logan Paul right there. What's your boy wearing? Oh, this is to do with all the controversy, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're making bank? Used to. Used to? What do you mean used to? Google took his ads away. I mean, if he ain't... If he ain't making no money than this dude, man. You know, the poor people always win this shit. They're fighting for money. They, you know, they're hungry and shit. Yeah, I'm gonna go with your boy, uh, Logan Paul. I also wrestled in high school and college. Ah, uh, it's a wrap. Mental game. You won. As a mixed martial arts coach, who do you have winning? KSI or Logan Paul? I don't even know who the hell KSI is. I've never watched any uh, of the videos. Alright, this is KSI right here. KSI. KSI, this is him right here. He's a current YouTube boxing champion. So all that's, these YouTubers are boxing now. That's not it is. It is a thing. It is a thing. They fought for 10,000 people in England. Okay, this is Logan Paul. That's you Logan said Logan Paul. Paul wrestled? Logan Paul wrestled state champion in Ohio. Look, look, okay, because he wrestled and the fact that since, you know, he like fell off because he... Because you know he's yeah, a bad person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So since since nobody fucks with him, he'll he'll probably be able to fight really well because he's yeah. fighting for his life. He, he, he needs he needs this for his career. career. Okay, KSI though training, training with uh, Floyd Mayweather that and Badu. Is it MMA? KSI, you know. No, this not. This is boxing. This straight boxing. Oh, boxing? It's straight boxing. Nah. In this photo, KSI has boxing gloves on. Oh, you're right. He's ready. I thought he was just in a cool background. I thought he was in a Travis Scott video. Look at this. 
guys, look, Les is making his entrance. Ron is last time by TKO. That doesn't mean anything. TKO, what does he fight? Please stop. He TKO'd a bodybuilder. He's fighting another YouTuber. He's got down the middle like this. He's out. TKO. I know. Easy question for TJ. The guy who wrestled in high school or the guy who fought a YouTuber? He's a state champion in Ohio. But are they are they boxing? Or they're, boxing they're, they're boxing, they're boxing, they're boxing. I'm gonna say KS5. Cause even though his boxing is probably garbage, he's done it. Whereas the wrestler, sorry, for all you wrestlers out there, every wrestler I've ran into starts with terrible hands. Oh there you go. They start out terrible. Yeah. They can, they can get, get they really, can get good, really good. good. Really good. But they always start out stiff. So I think he's got a KSI's got a leg up. Just okay, I'm going with Logan Paul. Logan bit. Paul. I'm going with Logan Paul because he's fighting for his career. You know, you, you can't have that many mess ups. <laughs> you, you need to like, you need to fix this. Oh yeah. You Ask John Jones, you can have that man. So <laughs> knock it off. Me personally, my take on the whole Logan Paul versus KSI fight, my prediction, I think KSI is doing an excellent job working with all these different trainers and boxers and getting his hands ready. He looked really good in the fight against Joe Weller and really displayed that he had hands and determination and to, you know, finish the fight against Joe. Joe looked good too. I mean, like, you know what? It's a, it's a big deal going there and fighting. So my respect, hats off to Joe in general. Logan Paul though, as much as people hate him being a head ass or whatever, Whatever. The dude did wrestle in high school at a pretty high level. I'm pretty sure he was a state champion or a top qualifier at state in the state of Ohio. So wrestling is obviously not the same as boxing, but it is a combat sport. And I think the benefit of that is he has the experience in the mad time competing against other people at a very high level and being ready for that moment, especially in combat sports. It's super different when you finally get into the ring or on the mat and are competing or fighting. It's super different than training. When you're training, your training partners might be going super hard or as hard as they can, but at the end of the day, you still know you guys are good friends and that, you know, it's a safe environment. When you're fighting, the energy is totally different. You can literally feel the aggressiveness and the negative energy or vibes off that person trying to hurt you. So it's a totally different ball game. And Logan Paul is super experienced with that, with guys shooting doubles on him, you know, trying to slam him, suplex him, whatever, you know. Jake Paul and Logan Paul are both the most game opponents on YouTube right now for anyone. My overall take on the Logan Paul versus KSI fight, I have Logan Paul winning the fight. Wrestlers not might have the best hands off the bat, but I think with the combat experience he does have and the more training he's gonna get, I think he's gonna be KSI. I'm a huge KSI fan. I'll be rooting for KSI. Hopefully he comes back with a dub. It's honestly a win-win situation. Uh, at the end of the day, most people on the internet are not the biggest fans of Logan Paul. So KSI taking this fight and going there and fighting them, he's kind of like the people's champ, the people's hero. So whatever he does is gonna be okay. And if he loses, it's gonna be okay too because people are still gonna say he tried his best. He went in against Logan Paul and he's gonna come back as a hero as well. I'm super excited to see it. I think it's cool attention, especially seeing guys like Adam Saleh, he's 13 and 0 in amateur boxing coming in. We got Vitaly, I hope he gets knocked out by Fusi. Fusi trying his best and you know, I'm seeing these positive changes in Fusi because he's doing combat sports, a, you know, a martial art and getting his mental right, his, his psyche right, and just being a healthy overall person. Ooh, damn. And if I'm gonna add a little input with the Jake Paul versus Comedy Shorts Gamer fight, I got Jake Paul absolutely mauling the guy. I'm a big fan of CSG. I think he's absolutely hilarious. Him being in the ring with Jake Paul is definitely not the move. Deji, Deji. My man, I'm a huge fan of yours. Absolutely hilarious. I'm rooting for the brothers, you know, the, the Oli G, BT brothers. I got the Paul brothers winning, you know. I got the Paul brothers winning, but I'll be rooting for y'all. And let's see what happens. If you made it to the end of the video, thank you so much for watching. My thoughts on the boxing scene on YouTube. If I miss anything, if you want more videos like this, let me know down below. Honestly, I wish they did MMA fight instead. And if I had, you know, more clout, like a million subscribers, I would love to jump in this mix and have some fun. Actually, I wouldn't because I'm actually competing for real and this would not be fair. But other than that, guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe, comment, share with your homies. Maybe if Logan Paul or Jake Paul or case i watch this i hope you guys all have a fun and good fight um you know keep doing your thing exposing boxing and martial arts and combat sports to youtube thank you guys so much for watching make sure to subscribe like comment all that jazz stay safe stay savage peace i got options i'm the first brown boy to get it popping if i 